Kids mingle at home. Mom's having a meltdown. The nanny was angry. She took out her cane and hit the ground. The kids quieted down instantly. Then the fight resumed. This time, they were the ones who got hit. They couldn't control their arms and legs. The children asked to stop. The babysitter made a request, asked the kids to apologize to each other, and promised not to fight again. But the kids wouldn't apologize, so they couldn't stop, noticing that their father's letters were about to be burned. So they started apologizing. The letters flew toward the fireplace, and the nanny's cane strikes again. Everything stood still. The exception was the crow. He flew over the stove and took the letter. Nanny shook her stick again. The children returned to normal. This was the moment they learned to be obedient and polite, and the mole on Nanny's face disappeared. The piglet that was to be sold ran away, so the children split up. Two boys were catching the piglet. The pig climbed up a tree. The piggy practiced gymnastics on the branch. And finally, with the elasticity of the branch, it flew up. The pig in his arms suddenly runs away. The boys are in hot pursuit. The pig jumped up in the air and plunged into the river and did some gymnastics. The children smiled happily. The pig was running around. The children worked together on a strategy. They caught all the pigs. The children brought the pigs back. Mom got the money she wanted. The pilot sneezed. A switch was accidentally triggered. A missile fell down. The policeman went to defuse the bomb, but he fell off the missile. The children united again. With everyone's cooperation, the missile's fuse was cut. But just as the children were getting excited, the detonation program suddenly started. It turns out that there is still a green wire left to be cut. But the green wire was buried in the glue. The crows flew in and ate the glue. The green wire was finally cut. The crows ate the special glue. Its stomach grew bigger and bigger. It was about to explode. Nanny told everyone to get out of the way. With a blow from her walking stick, the crow blew a magical wind. To the amazement of the children, the harvest of a huge field of wheat was over. Seeing the family happily together, she smiled warmly.